Hello there, Gemini. Thank you so much for stopping by for your weekly tarot video forecast. This forecast is for the week of October 7th through the 13th. While I'm shuffling the cards, let me remind you all that I do offer private readings either by phone or by Skype. If you're in the U.S., contact my cell phone, either text or call. Overseas, contact me on Skype, text or call. All my contact information and information about my readings is on the website listed below. I think we're just about done shuffling here. I would like to be done shuffling here. You guys have a lot on your mind this week, Gemini. Whew. Let's see what comes up. Hmm. All mine are arcana. Okay. All right, let's see, let's see. On Mondays, Geminis, what you have is the Ten of Arrows in reverse. This just means that you are going to be teaching somebody something. You will be the instructor or the teacher. You could be orienting somebody, uh, like a new employee at work. You could be literally teaching a class. You could be teaching one person some kind of skill for themselves. But you're teaching somebody something on Monday. On Tuesday, Gemini, you have the Page of Stones showing up here in reverse. Page of Stones in reverse is telling me that you're having a hard time keeping your balance. And for a lot of you, Geminis, I'm picking up that this is um, more of an emotional thing. Like you're having a hard time keeping your emotions on an even keel balance on Tuesday, Geminis. For some of you, this is over-the-top excitement and happiness. And for others of you, this is kind of going the other direction. But for a lot of you, this is actually, you're feeling very excited and happy and you're having a hard time containing yourselves. Let's look at Wednesday here. We have the Nine of Vessels. By the way, this is my Wildwood Tarot deck. Nine of Vessels is just telling me on Wednesday that things are operating really smoothly around you. Things are coming together very well, especially when it comes to your interactions with other people. Those are working out really well on Wednesday. Thursday. Thursday, you do have the Page of Arrows showing up in reverse. And this is a card that just tells me that you are uh, you're digging for information about something that I call a secret of the universe. Um, secrets of the universe are anything that influences our world that is not taught about generally in school. So metaphysical things, occult, um, arcane, uh, things like mediumship, psychic abilities, um, a lot of times things to have to do with the spiritual nature in any way, energy healing, stuff like that. There's something in that realm and that secrets of the universe realm that is calling you it's got your curiosity going and you're checking it out for some of you you're just finding out if it's for real or not for others of you that have already checked it out to the point that you know it's real you're figuring out how can i apply this in my life and make it do uh, better things for me okay now and i don't mean that in a negative way i don't mean like you're trying to figure out how to cast spells on other people and ruin their lives or anything like that. I just mean you're trying to figure out how do you master, like say for instance, a metaphysical law, or how do you man master energetic healing and how do you apply that more practically in your life? Okay, so let's move on to Friday. Here we have my insecurity card in reverse. This just means that something that you were feeling insecure about, now you are not for whatever reason, whether you have new information or whether you've just done some healing on yourself. Either way, insecurities are fading away. La -da 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 -da. Saturday. Saturday, you have my boredom card and this card is uh, many times a very literal card. Um, you could be bored Saturday. You could be feeling like whatever it is you're doing is just not using enough of your creative faculties to keep you interested in whatever it is. And then Sunday, we have the otter showing up in reverse. This is just telling me that on Sunday, you are having a hard time getting your heart to match up with what your head is saying. So your heart's feeling one thing, your head is saying another. So there are things that make sense, but there are things that feel like the right thing to do, and they don't necessarily match. That's what we've got coming up for you on Sunday. Okay, Geminis. Thank you, all of you, for being here. I'm looking forward to seeing some of you here this week for readings. And the rest of you, I'll see you back on the next video. Peace out.